our 2021 wine tasting fundraiser. We gave all of our donors an opportunity to hear more about the work that we're doing to build stronger, more resilient communities. And tonight, it was very evident that everybody had a really good time. We had Kayvon here. Florida and Texas are like the Donald Trump of states. And we also had comedian and magician Justin Rivera. So this is where we're going to fold this into a small packet. And violinist and pianist Elizabeth Bacher. Hope that everybody had a good time, and we hope that everybody continues to tune in and all the great things that we're doing in our community to make them stronger and more resilient. I just want to remind everybody that if you would like to donate on your mobile phone, you can go to lampkinfoundation.org forward slash donate. You can put in any amount that you want. If you want to make purchases from the bar, bottles are $25 for our fundraiser, which are very, um, very uh, rare bottles that were provided to us by San Antonio Winery. There's also glasses available for $5 and also mixed drinks are available for 10 So please continue to enjoy yourselves. So my name is Christina, and um, I heard about the Lampkin Foundation through Tawana Hill when she was the scholarship chair last year and asked me to be part of the scholarship committee. How did the Lampkin Foundation affect my life? Well, for one, it introduced me to a lot of very amazing people who are doing some great things in the community. And I kind of have that natural want to help the community and you know sometimes you don't know how to go about doing that and so the foundation has given me a way to try to impact the people around me and in my community. For one, just what it's doing in the community. I love the idea of the scholarship fund that um, they want to encourage kids in the area to give to the community and to continue giving even once they're done with high school and into college. Um, I love that they have that food bank to support families in need, the disaster relief. Yeah, just all, all the stuff they do for the community here, which I think is wonderful. I think a lot of times we focus on things happening outside of our immediate vicinity, and it's nice to give locally. Give. <laughs> give your time. If that's what you can give, give your money if that's what you can give. Um, tell other people about the foundation if that's what you're good at. I think we all have different gifts and talents that can benefit. And you just have to know what yours is because it will help. My name is Eugene Canada and I'm one of the directors for a new trucking company and also a safety officer for a May trucking company. Uh, I'm at the Lampkin Foundation at the top of the year. And uh, I've always wanted to be in uh, philanthropy. I met them through my friend Tawana Hill. You know, she was uh, becoming one of the directors there. And uh, in trucking, we get a lot of over, over good surplus, things like that. And we're trying to find places to donate this food so we would have to throw it away. And so through Tawana, I met DeAndre. And then I started servicing the food to them so they could service people in Ontario that were in need of food. So that's that's how I met the Lampkin Foundation. And I like them what they do, you know, just uh, taking care of community, taking care of families, you know, filling in the gap for these needs. So I think you should donate to the Lampkin Foundation because they have great ties to many people in the city and you know just pulling everybody's resources together to get it to the people that need it. And that's what I get. I'm Jayla Brooks, and this is my first Lampkin Foundation event. I was invited by my friend from high school, Naya Palmer, and she's actually been working with Lampkin for about a year or so. Um, this is a beautiful event. I love wine, love wine tasting. Any time that I get to come out and give to a charity um, and get dressed and have a good time, I will. So far, it's been nothing but pure like, great ambiance, great people, just a lot of things to take in and the charity itself has brought a lot of light to me. Um, I want to donate again and again and again. They're putting together so many different things. They have their hand and their foot in everything, every type of outreach and just it, the possibilities are endless. 
and they have everything for somebody. And if you find something that you want to give to and it's on your heart, do it because it's worth it. It's going to go to a good cause. They take care of people here in the States, here in California. They take care of people out of the country, in Puerto Rico, all types of disaster plans, and even just growing the community where they are. It's a beautiful outreach, beautiful foundation, beautiful charity. 10 out of 10 would recommend, and I will for sure come back. Hi, my name is Courtney Osteen, and I am a five-year supporter of the DeAndre D. Lemon Foundation. It's been an honor to watch DeAndre grow the organization over the past five years, starting as an intimate setting and becoming one of the most well-known contributors in the Inland Empire. DeAndre and his team of professionals has assembled great contributors to the city of Ontario, as well as across the United States and overseas. If you're looking for a great organization to connect with, we would love to involve you and have you sit on our board, and we can have you be a benefactor for us as well. If you have any questions about the DeAndre D. Lampkin Foundation, please make sure you check us out on the internet, and hopefully we'll see you at our next fundraiser. Who knows, it may be a wine taster, we may go back to our gala, but we would love to involve you in the community.